like to acknowledge the efforts of the Legislative Drafting Division led by Mrs. Mavis Amwa in the Office of the Attorney General for their hard work and commitment in carefully drafting the provisions of the, the, the Act. Indeed, all these efforts have not gone unnoticed, as our Cybersecurity Act 2020, Act 1038, is now considered world-class legislation at par with similar legislation in the United States, the United Kingdom, Singapore, Rwanda, and other countries with robust cybersecurity legislation. And that is what has resulted in our ranking as third in Africa on the ITU Cybersecurity Index and 43rd globally with a score of 86.69%. Incidentally, in 2017, we recorded a score of 32.6%. And that is when we realized that we needed to step up our efforts in this regard. Ghana scored 19.35% out of a total of 20% regarding the legal regime. That's not bad. And this high score was achieved because of the passage of our law. We couldn't have done this without the unflinching support provided by international partners, including the government of the United Kingdom, the United States, the World Bank, the Council of Europe, UNICEF, and the Commonwealth Initiative, amongst others, and our domestic stakeholders. His Excellency the President's commitment to and recognition of cybersecurity as an imperative to securing our digital economy was also affirmed by his assent to the Act on December 29, 2020, for implementation. <clears throat> 